Hello, Andrew Hewlett here with my questions for God. And today I wanted to look at the question, who made God? You've probably heard that before. I'm sure people have asked you that question. The first time I ever heard that question, I felt like it was hit like a two by four. <laughs> I had to really scratch my head. I felt like I was really blindsided by it. But in reality, it it demonstrates that people perhaps see God in a in a limited way. Maybe people are seeing God like a some old man out in the living in a castle out in the Andromeda galaxy or, or something like that within our space and time. But no, um, God uh, does not live in a um, a linear time frame. God is outside space and time. So. Um, you need to keep that in mind. The main answer to this question, though, is that it makes no sense if you look at it really carefully. The definition of God is, is what? Someone who's eternal and self-existing. So to say who made God is to say who made that which was never made. If you, if you think about this carefully and reflect on it, you can see, can see it's a, a contradiction of terms. The question makes no sense to say who made the God who was never made, who always existed. It's a nonsensical question. It's like uh, maybe if I said, imagine a, re a long line that's eternally long, that goes on forever and ever and ever. Now imagine that. And if I said, now, how many miles long is that? You'd laugh. You'd say, that's crazy. You can't tell how many miles long it is because you've said already that it's it it goes on forever and ever and it's the same um, thing with God asking who made God who had no beginning and I'm amazed at the number of people that do ask this question um, you know if God had a beginning and was created that uh, then it would be a good question but the God that we believe in is uncreated and he's, he is eternal to say who created the uncreated God makes no sense at all. So at one point, this was kind of a thought-provoking question that uh, kept me up at night. But now I can see it really doesn't make any sense at all. It doesn't bother me at all. Anyways, I promised that I would uh, end each little video with a joke. You may have heard this one because it's been floating around out there for quite a number of years, but it's kind of cute. A man was praying to God and he said, God, God responded, yes. And the guy said, can I ask a question? Go right ahead, God said. God, what is a million years to you? God said, a million years to me is only a second. Hmm, the man responded. Then he asked, what is a million dollars worth to you? And God said, a million dollars to me is as a penny. So the man said, God, can I have a penny? And God cheerfully said, sure, just a minute. <laughs> Anyways, I thought that was kind of cute. Um, I'm going to be posting more on my channel, my questions for God. So please tune in again soon.